how's it going everyone this is sean from scale model car guy channel back again with my finals on the small scale group build hosted by mr bg brian and myself uh sean and uh you know we host this every year starts february 1st ends the 28th or 29th just depends on the year <laughs> <clears throat> smallest scale for the smallest month all right guys uh <clears throat> as uh, y'all know i haven't been feeling good i haven't been on here i'm not you know you can tell by my voice i can barely speak but i've got to get these videos out guys but before i do thank you my subscriber thumbs up thumbs down whatever makes your world go around guys subscribing is free 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 i'll never ask you for a dime this is not this channel guys all i ever asked for is you to go and support anybody i mention in my videos uh all you know anybody in the community that i mention i always put a link below always below i will have a link to their channels if i shout them out their channels will be on there go check them out like share and subscribe guys that's all i ask for all right so y'all y'all know that i've done two two models here i've done the bond bug and the 63 corvette the bond bug was gifted to me by my buddy pete over at pete's model car customs over there in jolly old england and uh, actually he gifted me two i still got one in the box i built this one and uh then this in here was gifted to me by robert my buddy from a brother from another mother uh robert bishop and uh he gifted me that and he also resin or not resin cast 3d cast printed me engine front suspension rear end i mean you name it he printed it in small scale yes small scale and uh thank you robert bishop appreciate you uh r b model works his his uh, link will be in the description below too as long as pete's all right let's start this out let's start with this one right here the bond bug let me move these out of the way <clears throat> let's start with the bond bug i'm gonna put it out here on this thing right here as glenn would say the whirly jigger all right let's get in here yes i didn't do mine in the orange i did it in the uh lime green metallic you can see there this was a fun 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 detailed detailed for such a little kit it's an air fix kit my gosh this is a 1971 bond bug and hasn't been issued since like 1971. This is the first time it's been reissued. <coughs> the top does come off. So that you can see inside of here. Let's get it up there to you. I got my little <coughs> hippie behind the wheel here. I'm not no Gavin Booth. I'm not no figure painter, but I've done my best. Uh, you can see you got one hand on the shifter one on the wheel i put carpet in it two little carpet mats let's see get in here and let you get this detail see i i'm not good at facial features so you really don't have no facial features but and all the, that back glass does not fit guys that's the warning about I just had to set it in there. I, I could go back and fix it a little bit, but that that opening is too wide for that glass. Both kits. But, yeah, it is what it is. Here's the underneath. Very detailed. I even wired it up, even though you can't see it. There's the front. Look how cool that thing is. Yeah. See right there says Bond Bug, gas cap, 
bug, bond bug, right there in the front. Put that bad boy back together. Voila. All right, guys. There she is. Let's move that one out of the way. Put that over there by its... Now let's do the Corvette. And get this thing on here. Voila. There you go, guys. Now, I told y'all I was going to have it in a wheelie position. I didn't lie to you. The only thing is, I told you it wasn't going to be no stand under it because I was going to weight it. Well, I did weight it, but you cannot get enough weight back there because it's so small, the area I had to work with, that, yeah, it is what it is. So I still had to put a stand under it. You can see that little black pole I got under it. It is what it is. Check this out. Front wheels move. Look at that. I got him in the launch position. Boy, he's taking off. Metal grill I made for it myself. Uh, yeah. I put a driver figure in him. Seat belts. Battery back here for weight distribution. It's got a homemade fire extinguisher in it. Roll cage. Look at that. I tinted the windows with the Tamiya red tint, or Tamiya clear red. That is a uh, tester's, uh, same color as the other car, lime green or something like that. I can't remember what it's called. But yeah, what do you think about that, guys? Now, let's take it off the stand and get it in closer so that you can see what's going on. All right, you can see right there. Chrome full. You can see I got him driving. He's got one hand on the shifter. It's automatic. He's pulled back. He's got one hand on the steering wheel. You ain't going to be able to see, but I will have pictures. Here's the underneath. The wheels do turn. Pop that hood off there. Let's see if we can pop the hood off. There you go. Look at that 3D casted engine right there. Look at that. Look, you see the breather through the bug catcher. Two carbs. Tunnel rim. I got her wired up. I got the radiator hose. I got the cage around the engine. I even got a uh, master cylinder over there. The headers. You can see the headers. Still street legal, so uh, it's got the dumps on it where you can dump it off to the pipes, the ladder bars. Don't know if you can see in there, you know, the roll cage. There's the interior. All right, guys. What do you think about that? Boom. I mean, she is mean and green. My favorite colors, green. You can have her in any color you want, as long as it's green. Look at there. All right, guys, I'm going to give her one more little whirly whirl around here for you. You know what? I didn't get that light on. Oh, there you go. You can see it better. Look. I forgot. Oh, look how that shines. I forgot to turn the light on, but I'm not redoing the video, so. It is what it is, guys. Let's move this in closer. There you go. I will leave still pictures at the end. Check her out. All right. Thank you, Robert. Thank you, Pete. Thank you, Brian, for helping me host this. Guys, it's been fun. Uh, all you that have still got videos out there, and if I haven't got to watch any of them, please contact me and, and tag me, tag me in your videos. That way I can get them watched if I have not got over there and seen your small scale group build yet. Uh, 
like I said I've been sick so I, there's not been a lot of YouTube watching but uh and I appreciate every one of you guys that's joined in whether you finish or not it don't matter it's just all about having fun all right guys love y'all bye